And before we begin, if you're watching the impeachment coverage just now, you can continue watching on KSAT.com. A vote is expected to be taken at some point tonight. We're keeping a close eye on that vote, and we'll have an update in our later newscast. And of course, we'll go to Capitol Hill later in this newscast. Meantime, here at home, less than a week after a wounded Army veteran's truck was stolen with his Purple Heart medal inside, Police have caught the suspect, Hector Bernal, taken into custody just moments ago. Courtney Freeman live where that suspect was walked in front of our cameras. Courtney. Stephen Ursula, the truck that we're talking about was found on Sunday and police today this afternoon arrested their suspect. 30 year old Hector Bernal was already known to vehicle crime detectives. Police say Thursday night while Ryan and Asia Davis were staying in a hotel, Bernal stole their F-150 parked outside. Inside were Ryan's military coins, his American flag, medical paperwork, Christmas presents, and of course his Purple Heart. This summer he was badly injured by an IED in Afghanistan, he lost both legs, his right hip and his right arm. Sunday, detectives found the truck on the south side near I-35 in South Zarsamora. The Purple Heart and military memorabilia were left inside. The presents, clothing and medical paperwork, though, were gone. Police arrested Bernal today on the west side near St. Cloud, and there they found another stolen vehicle they believe was from a theft on November 13th. So Bernal is now charged with two counts of vehicle theft, and police say there may be more charges to come. They also say this is a great reminder, especially for the holidays, to always lock your vehicle and make sure no property inside is visible. Steve. 